Hey guys, Brox here. Doing a quick video because I was asked by a Reddit user, Scooby-Doo, to prove that these uh, MK18 and M4A1 are pretty much identical in Grey Zone Warfare. We don't know the base stats because they're hidden. If the devs want to actually provide those, that would be great. Um, but outside of that, uh, I was asked to test the recoil difference um, and what the guns do and how they react um, differently and see if that actually has any sway if they're built almost identically. So first we're going to test the MK18 uh, with M M uh, M855A1 ammo and we're going to do it on one time zoom and then we're going to do it again with the M4 and then I'm going to do it with the MK18 with the M4 lower. So the M uh, MK18 upper with the M4 lower which is the most optimal weight setup for uh, tier 3. But this is the MK18 recoil pattern. So that's that on the wall. Then we're going to swap out the <clears throat> FSP handguard onto the M4 so that they have identical setups. I'm going to unload and reload the ammo again just so everyone can see the stats are exactly the same. Nothing has changed. Ammo is the same. Nothing variance to there that these are uh, basically identical setups and then we're going to use the M4 here. We'll go line up on the other wall. Make sure we have one time zoom. I'm waiting for my arm uh, stamina so that again everything is as fair as possible. Looked almost identical checking MK18 versus M4. If you actually look here, the M4 has a better on center for the first 10 bullets than the MK18, just standard by itself. So then we're going to swap and we're going to put the uh, MK18 upper on the M4 lower. So we're going to take that off. We're going to put the MK18 um, onto the M4. But we have to swap the FSP handguard again, so just grabbing that really quickly so that that can be evened out. And then the super finicky in stash gun system, so we're going to have to swap this into the backpack to get it to go on. So we'll just throw it in the backpack, boom, fixed it. So now when we look, same stats, nothing has changed, just a lighter gun now. Um, about 0 0.05 kilograms less weight. So we're going to put that in. We're going to reload it. And then we're going to do a final spray pattern with the combination. So this is an MK18 upper with an M4 base. Make sure our zoom is correct. Wait for the arm stamina. And then spray. Recoil ends up in the same spot, but if you look, this combination actually has a better, tighter uh, hit marker for the first 10 bullets. It's very identical to the straight M4, even with the MK18 upper. The MK18 looks actually less accurate, just as a MK18 base by itself, um, where the MK18 with the M4 lower actually looks like it has a better overall a uh, consistent spread with a lighter weight to it. The MK18 by itself looks like the worst option of the three. So there you go. Tested and uh, any questions, let me know or anything else you want me to test, let me know.